Kevin Doolan joining me now ahead of the new 2013 Speedway season. For yourself, it's a case of new beginnings, really. Yeah, we're at Lister this year, so it's a, it's a track I like and somewhere I've enjoyed going. It's only an hour from my doorstep, so that's an advantage as well. So I'm just looking forward to the start of the season now. Have you had a lot of contact with the Leicester promotion in the past or is it something that's just come completely out of the blue this winter? No, I've, I've been in contact with them. I've like, spoke to them in the off-seasons of other years. and um, Yeah, I'd, I'd, well, I'd, I'd call Dave Helmsley a friend. He's a guy I've got along with really well over the last couple of years. So it's one of them. I, it was an obvious choice to uh, make contact with him in the off-season and we worked out a deal. Last season didn't quite work out how you might have expected, really. Just talk us through last year from your perspective. It was just a funny one. I mean, I wasn't really hitting a stride at Ipswich. I couldn't couldn't get things right, and, you know, I, I tried a lot of things. I tried a lot of ways of getting things to go better, but just couldn't quite put my finger on it. And um, it, then I got dropped from Ipswich, and I went to Redcar. And if things did get better once I went to Redcar, Red I, I enjoyed it there. I knew that, uh, you know, I, I was doing my job, and everyone was happy with that. You know, I ended up with a pretty decent average at, at, at Redcar, so I can't really complain. It was, um, it was funny because at the end of the season, I was the uh, highest average rider at Ipswich on the books, and um, then I'd had a good time at, and lifted my average at Redcar. So. All change for yourself then this uh, coming season, but all change for Leicester as well. As I understand it, there have been some uh, track changes. Yeah, I think they moved the uh, pole line in, which is probably needed. They, uh, they had a... They've got a really good setup there, and um, yeah, they're, they're a little bit disappointed over the last two years about there not being enough passing, not being enough racing room. So I think they've moved the pole line in, and yeah, that should make a big difference. And uh, a few new riders, new faces. Uh, have you met your teammates? Do you know who's who's racing alongside you this season? Yeah, I've pretty much yeah had something to do with everybody in the team at some stage over the years. I mean, Kake is a great kid, and. Um, obviously, Adam Ryan and I've rode with him before, so there's no real strange faces there. Um, I haven't really made any contact yet so far this season, just simply because it's too bloody cold. And, uh, yeah, no, I'll, I'll start to wind things up soon and get ready for the season. Any uh, practice during the winter for yourself, or is it literally just the flat track and then and then back into uh, your standard speedway stuff when the season begins? I just do my fitness stuff and, you know, a little bit of motocrossing and stuff like that just to keep myself sharp. I mean, I rode the, um, the Somerset meeting the other week and that went okay. There was no, no big issues there. I was happy with that. And once the weather gets better, I'll start practicing at uh, Leicester. I think you know, two or three practices will be ready for the season. There won't be, I won't be spinning 100 laps wearing myself out and the bike out because it's too cold to be washing bikes this time of year. Yeah, very cold, isn't it? Um, last season we had all sorts of dramas with weather and such like. Um, this season, hopefully, it'll be a bit better because last year was a bit of a drain, really, wasn't it, by the end of the year? Yeah, it was terrible last year. I mean, I, I was lucky. I, uh, I was OK when we were at Ipswich and I got sacked from there. And then I moved to Redcar and then we got through our meetings at Redcar. So uh, I dodged the rain for most of the season. Can't really complain. But, I mean, we had so many meetings rained off away from home that... It really puts a dent in your season. It makes finances hard to manage, and you know it, it's it's well destructive. You know you, you just can't plan for it. So we've hope, got to hope for a better summer. You're one of the more experienced riders in the Premier League these days, uh, so you <laughs> so you must have an idea of you know how a team stacks up against teams you've ridden for before. Does the Leicester team look one of the strongest in the league? It's definitely strong. I mean, you can never really tell until. You, you see it in, you know, in anger really. You know, you see the guys making passing manoeuvres and stuff like that. That's that's when you know you got a good team. But um, you know, if we can settle in early, not uh, have any injuries, and you know, get a bit of team spirit, I'm sure we'll be fine. And have you had a look at any of the other teams, or do you just literally turn up and race who you race? Do you have an idea of who might be there or thereabouts with Leicester? I don't really take much notice, to be honest. Um, I like to just chill out during the winter and. I like to concentrate on keeping myself fit and keeping myself, you know, ready for the next season. Really, it's not. I've I've been in uh, teams that were meant to finish middle to bottom, and we've won the league. I've been in teams that meant to win the league, and we've finished middle to bottom. So, you know, you can't predict anything beforehand. You've just got to, you know, take it as it comes. 
and how much are you looking forward to a new season? Because you've had a couple of months away from uh, from speedway racing regularly now. Are you itching to get back going again? Yeah, I'm, I'm getting sick of not having that uh, continuous adrenaline rush. <laughs> um, I, as I said, I like to ride bikes, I ride motocross and flat track and stuff. But, you know, nothing's the same as the focus you get when you're riding constantly, professionally. And, you know, it changes your changes your body, you start to be quicker and smarter and more decisive and I enjoy that. Looking forward to the new season then? Definitely.